Let's um, let's switch gears a little bit on yes, theme yes, parks. Yes. Okay, I understand English. We have enough. We have enough theme parks. There's supposed to be like a Star Wars one now. Oh, oh, I'm going to. Okay. So, wh wh how do you guys feel about that? Bring it on! I'm you, ready. You think so? Dude, if you've ever been to Hollywood Studios and been in the Star Wars ride, the one ride that they have, uh -huh, it's amazing. Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. I said Star Wars. Okay, excuse me. Um, you would love the fact that there could be a possibility with an interactive like theme park specifically for Star Wars. They already have a Marvel theme park, like in Disney ones, right? So that, and they do theme parks well. So why is everyone complaining? I think it's because okay. it's all the way in Florida. Yeah. My thing is, though, um, no offense to those of us who are from Florida and have, like, an affinity for it or whatever. I feel that if you're going to make a Star Wars theme park, we should take down Raging Waters because no one goes there anymore. We should take down Knots mm -hmm. and put the Star Wars park and a Harry Potter park there because Florida doesn't deserve another amusement park. I'm sorry. And, they just and, don't. Uh, and, um, they just I'm, don't. I'm sorry, but... I think California is just too expensive. Wow. Okay. I mean, it's like, land it, but it's Star Wars. You you wouldn't make that trip just to no, go to a Star Wars world. Do you know how much land, empty land, there is in Florida? It's just land. From the top, from where I live to Miami, is like six hours. Like, there's mm -hmm. so much empty space for them to put an amusement park. Like, where? On fault lines, are they gonna put the new stuff? <laughs> we will mount the point. That's why I say tear down the older parks and then we can just put it on top of Raging Waters and San Dimas. Come on, that's totally accessible. And I personally I don't I don't mess with Florida like that. I just can't make that no. I, I think they should the get rid of Central Park in Manhattan and do it there. Yes. Uh I haven't been to Central Park yet, so once I go and I visit it. Then when I'm done, it's like, all right, tear it down. Let's get let's get some work in. Yeah, let's... I think it's gonna be awesome though. The, I I mean, Disney does theme parks right. They have theme parks across the world. I mean, it would make sense for them to put it in a place like Florida, where they've already tested the grounds with Star Wars rides and having Star Wars weekends like May the Fourth. Like that's a whole um, Star Wars day dedicated mm -hmm. where the park is just that. So they've already have like um, a fan base that knows to go to Florida for Star Wars. So I feel like if they jump locations, it's going to really screw with a lot of people. I think the best thing out of that is you could actually walk into Endor and <laughs> hang out with Ewoks, like just like trees and trees. Gonna, and... I mean, well, I like the area, the Ewoks, tiny bears. Come on, homie. That that's another that's a story for another day, but yeah. yeah and yeah. they're also making um the Avatar world in um Animal Kingdom, Disney. The Navi with the, the yeah. blue tail. Yeah. Cool, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I think it's gonna be cool. A mm -hmm. theme park with just that? Or just it's a gonna ride? be a part it's gonna be a part of Animal Kingdom, a theme park that already exists. Oh, okay. Um mm -hmm. which doesn't have a lot of stuff there anyway. They need to redo it. So what's really awesome is if you've seen Avatar, you know their trees are huge but in um animal kingdom they have the giant tree of life where it's like carvings of like certain um over a hundred different like animal carved into like wow this huge awesome tree but there's like it's mostly um sit down rides and like live like jeep stuff okay. well, since, well since exactly. they're doing this with star wars and dean i know you're a huge star trek fan do you think it's possible to see a theme park with star trek would you want to see that as a fan or no not really I think we <laughs> did we troll him away. All of it, I think there's just uh, just a money making thing. I you know I don't get suckered into that stuff. But I mean, so you wouldn't want to visit? Do I care? Jeez, talk about a stoic. Um, you said yeah, just, you would or no? No, I no. Asked, well, you know, no. Why would he? Like, why would I care? No, stop. I mean, like, I mean I've, been to, I've been to a few, and it's all this. You know, it's all the same stuff. I don't. I don't. You know, what's the big deal? Have you been so to a few? What do you mean a few? Yeah, you know, I've been to Universal, I've been to Epcot, I've been to all of them. I mean, it's, you know, you want to see one, you've seen them all. But, but, but that's so, what the thing is, is this next The thing is, you Star Wars, uh, you got to look at who owns these, these franchises. Marvel, Star Wars, it's all Disney. All they care about is making a buck. I mean, so you we wouldn't visit just... I feel like if that's all they cared about, they wouldn't be doing... They can do whatever the heck they want. It's not about making money. They're they're rehashing oh, out their old stories and making money off of their old stories. The copyright. All Disney cares about is money. You I look understand. at other movies, it's a copy of another movie. Of yeah, another but it's movie the same... Movie. Like, what I'm saying Disney is Disney's so much money. 
they you gotta be kidding. So D- they can do whatever they, they want. They can. So, they're making money off of their own stuff right now. They're making Cinderella live action. Are you serious? Live action. It's, and they're making just as much money. Right. So more power to them. them. They got That's every right. Thing, if they want so to make Dean, a music part, what? I'm sorry. So the thing is, you even just for the base enjoyment of walking into a life-size replica of the Starship Enterprise, because you're so anti-establishment, you're like, okay, I'm not going to go experience this just for the whimsy, because I feel that the evil corporations are just trying to sap more money out of me. If that's your stance, that's fine. But I just they're just trying to get. They just want to make money. That's cool. You want to go spend your money that way. That's cool. Okay, no I one's asking. Oh, yeah, but this is I'm not gonna waste my time. I got, I got my kids. I got my stuff to do. I got my. Why am I? Gonna, well, you know, I'm gonna stop. Okay, right. okay. Let's, let's no. Let's play with that though. Hypothetically, what if the kids want to go? Yeah. No. Okay. Well, let me ask you this: Is there any? And I'll say through all of you: If there's we any cartoon, any anime, anything that you just totally yeah. like that you wish they can make a theme park, what would it be? That they you already would have want to it. go to. They already have it. It's ju- one Which one? It's Jump Land. It's Jump Land in Japan. It's basically all the Shonen Jump characters, and it's like a theme park. I'm going one day. That's it's that simple. Wow. Um, and- yeah, for me, there. Okay, I have two options. One I wish, and then one that I need to go to that I know exists which is also in Japan, so I'll start with that one, is Resident Evil. They do it, like, for Halloween. They have, like, a whole, like, interactive Resident Evil, like, land, and you can, like, go in and, like, kill zombies with your friends and stuff. Wow. And they have, like, the characters, like, in there. It's so awesome. I want to go. And then nice. what I wish they had is Kingdom Hearts, which is pretty much Disney. Disney. <laughs> but um, I wish they would add more of a... Uh, more of the aspect of like the Final Fantasy into it, which would be cool. So more square, less Mickey Mouse. Yeah, and more of like the Sora aspect, like that. Like we don't have like a even a corner like that in Disney yet, which means, which kind of sucks. You would think they might have like an area dedicated where you can, I don't know, go on a virtual like ride through the world. Like I don't know, it'd be fun. And Dean, if yes. there, if there was one that you'd be willing to go to that you wish existed that doesn't, what would it be, based on? Come on. He wouldn't go. He wouldn't go. He's not going to waste his time. He's not going to waste his time. I'm going to waste my time. I, not even in a I, hypothetical you, capacity. You, you want to get some fun. I mean, you want to... If it's fun for you, then go to these parks. I don't... To me, I don't, I don't get a joy. I'm saying, like, what don't you... What don't you I don't like, like standing on, on lines where it's only, like, a freaking five or ten minute thing. <laughs> what, 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 like, what do you like? What do you like? What do you like? We'll start there. Like, the lines. I like I history. Think. I like going out. I like, you know. History world. There's a history world. <laughs> there is? They yeah, talk about I like the real so history. Right? I will. <laughs> I will fly to Germany and walk through maybe Auschwitz or whatever and see, you know, horror stuff I, I know about and rather than deal with freaking going into a thing. No, man. I don't do these, 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 these little things anymore yeah but yeah. did that a long time ago it's all the same stuff yeah, you know what you are in here? I think it's let it go next <laughs> next topic let's go <laughs> <All right. laughs>